So let me go to the final round. Fingers on the buzzer teams. Question coming up now. In his controversial book, Partition of India, Legend Real Reality, the author challenged the existing view that blamed the Partition of India on Jinnah and the Muslim League. He argued that it was the latent bias on the part of the Indian National Congress leadership which resulted in partition. Name the famous constitutional jurist and acclaimed lawyer who's the author of this book. Who are we talking about? No one taking the risk. Okay, yes. They say Palki Wala, it fits the constitutional jurist and acclaimed lawyer a bit. Not Nani Palki Wala. So minus 10 for CLC Delhi. So this is not my, uh, Nani Palkiwala. This is anyone in the audience? H.M. Sirvai is the right answer. H.M. Sirvai, famous constant lawyer. This is H.M. Sirvai. Fingers on the buzzer teams. Second question now. This word is derived from old French for later born or younger and tense inferior. The anglicized version of this word is an adjective and has come to mean weak or undersized. It's a legal term used mainly in British English, main meaning inferior in rank. Yes, NLSIO. Puny, like a judge. Puny, judge, puny is the right answer. That's the answer that we were looking out for. Plus 10 to NLSIO. Fingers on the buzzer stains. Next question coming up on the screen now. Samal Das Gandhi was a... Okay, so they've gone for the... Junagar. So Samal Das Gandhi was behind the princely state. Junagar, that's right. We are looking for, that's right. So Junagar is what we were looking for. Samal Das led a government of Junagar's citizens to ensure that Junagar joined India. That's the right answer. Going on a flash, getting it right. Plus 10 to GNLU. Teams, fingers on the buzzer. Next question coming up on the screen now. So Idea of Justice, the book by Amartya Sen, is on, on, written in honor of his teacher. Yes, unless you need an answer. Um, his, his teacher, Ro Rawls. No. Okay, I need one answer. You, you've given an answer. They Rawls. said Rawls, and that's the right answer. Oh. This is John Rawls, and the theory of justice is what John Rawls wrote, and he wrote the idea of justice. This was John Rawls. Fingers on the buzzer teams. Next question coming up on the screen now. So RZ Hakumat, NLS, NLS. You guys have gone for the buzzer. Yeah, it's Azad Hind, the Azad Hind government. RZ Hakumat, EA, Azad Hind. That's the right answer. So the defending champions don't want to let it go easy. So this is Azad Hind. They get a plus ten. They get a plus ten. Fingers on the buzzer teams. Next question coming up on the screen now. So which landmark case does this title of the book refer to? Uh, yes, Indira Gandhi versus Rajna Ryan. Indira Gandhi versus Rajna Ryan. That's the right answer which led to the emergency. This is Indira Gandhi versus Rajna Ryan. That's the right answer. Plus 10 to Ramjas College. So a lot of action in the national finals. Next question on the screen. Fingers on the buzzer teams now. Noted historian Ramchandra Guha called him the wisest man in India. He adds that he has written about the contest between religion and secularism, caste, class, poverty, inequality. Yes. M.N. Srinivas. Oh. Sanskritization and all that. So M.N. Srinivas is what NLS say. Chronicles of our time and society and politics in India is by Andre Bettel. Okay. So this is Andre Bettel, a minus 10 to NLS. Next question coming up on the screen. Fingers on the buzzer teams. Now, Sonam Dash is an MLA in the Sikkim legislature. Yes? You guys went for it right away. I need an answer. Sonam Chom. What? Read the question. It's saying, I need an answer. They gave an answer. You, you, you guys. Son I Sonam Chombe. Okay. No, no. That is not what we are looking. We were looking for a unique category which is enabled by the People of Representation the Act. Action. The Buddhist monks or the Sangha community is what we were looking out for. Hard luck, Christ law. Hard luck. You guys have to be quick on the buzzer. This is the Sangha or the Buddhist monks. In fact, there's a provision for reservation for the Sanghas in the uh, Sikkim Legislative Assembly. That is what we were looking out for. Looking for. So next question. Fingers on the buzzer, teams. Now. Hyderi Manzal, situated in Calcutta, has a special significance. So this was where? Mahatma Gandhi was residing when the Calcutta riots happened with uh, H.S. Suravati. 
And your JS from Calcutta cracks it. This is the Hyderi Manzil. This is where Mahatma Gandhi ji was staying while we got independence, right? So a question from their hometown, but that's the national character of the quiz. So good 10 points for NUJS team two. So you guys want to have a score at this stage? Huh. Yeah. Let's have the scores. Uh, Campus Law Center 10, NUJS 10, Ram just college. 90 points, five points behind the leaders of the quiz at this stage, SLS Pune, LLSIU with 70 points, GNLU with 50 points, School of Law, Christ University at 70 points, NUJS team two with 20 points, can be anybody's game at this stage. Last two questions of the quiz coming up, fingers on the buzzers teams, now. Okay, NLSIU has gone for it. It's okay. Janagana Mana, it's a tune for Janagana Mana. So, Margaret Cousins came up with a musical notation for the Jana Gana Mana. That's the right answer. So, this is Jana Gana and Mana. That's the right answer. Margaret Cousins composed the tune for Jana Gana Mana. And when, he met, uh, when she met Rabindna Tagore, she's the uh, wife of James Cousins, a famous Irish poet. Last question, tiebreaker set. The last question of the quiz coming up on the screen. Now, okay, which word, yes, JNLU has gone for it, I need an answer. I need an answer now. Guys, it's, I need an answer, I'll push you for this because you went for the buzzer on the Let blinder. I would have to give you a negative minus 10 and audience, not indemnity, French word, which gets this word meaning death pledge. This is mortgage. Mortgage is what we're looking for. And with that, I think we have the winners and we have the results of the national finals. And the national champions of the Conquest 2017, Symbiosis Law School Pune with 95 points. Job well done. And NLSIU, the defending champions, giving that last minute fight, ensuring that they go after it. 80 points, great effort, NLSIU, and they coming third. And all the teams here, great effort. It truly is heartwarming when you guys compete this way and ensure. Thanks so much. From Team Walnut, thank you all. First of all, I would like to begin and thank everybody who participated and had the courage to come up. And I don't know the immense amount of efforts you must have put in to come up here. Um, so I come from the Friedrich Naumann Foundation, which is one of the smallest German political foundations. And uh, we work in the space of rule of law, human rights, and liberal democracy, economic freedom, and accountability in governance. Uh, we have been in India for about 30 years. We started partnering with the Center for Law and Policy Research a couple of years back. And it's been a phenomenal journey with them because we are proud partners in the civic engagement project that they have. Um, I'm not going to take more time, but I really thank everybody who is present here and who sees the sense in engaging on debates and discussions around the Indian Constitution. So thank you and congratulations to all the winners. Thank you, ma'am. And now for the prize distribution, I take this opportunity to thank and appreciate all the participants who have participated and come this far to the National Rounds of Conquest 2017. I'd like to call upon the second runner-up runner team, NLSIU Bangalore, Jaydev CS and Abhishek Chaudhary for the prize. And I'd request Dr. Father Jose to give away the prize to the participants. The first runners-up prize goes to Ramjas College, and I'd like to call Ashish Kumar Singh and Abhishek Paliwal to take the prizes. The winners of the National Rounds of Conquest 2017 are Karan Kamat and Amai Pillay from Symbiosis Law School, Pune. And I'd like to call Mr. Jairam to give away the prizes. <laughs> 